Alright, this is a tutorial on the new Equivox R EVR program by Danny Bigbeard Studios and this is on mode B, how to record your own sound bank. As you can see, I've got the phone attached with a wire to an external speaker and I've got an external recording device to record my session. Okay, you bring up, bring up your device, um, there's the app on the main menu. You've got the menu button and you've got the mode button and clear button. Okay, you want to put it in mode B. Tap this and it'll say right there mode B. Okay, when mode B comes up you'll notice it adds a right button to the left top. Okay, that's how you know you're in mode B. The first thing you want to do is add your your data bank okay now you can use anything you want for this you can sit there and recite the alphabet for 10 minutes or you can read a book you can turn on a TV program and just uh, hold it up to the TV you can play a YouTube video a speech a famous speech or something for this I'm going to use the Gettysburg address um, so basically, as soon as you hit the right button, you tap this right button here, it'll go into record mode, and then you start immediately whatever it is you want to fill your data bank with. So I'm going to do that real quick. I'm not going to record the full speech, just a little bit of it so that you can see how, that, how you do that. So here you go. Right? Four score and seven years ago. Our fathers brought forth on this continent a new nation, conceived in liberty and dedicated to the proposition that all men are created equal. Now we are engaged in a great civil war, testing whether that nation or any nation so conceived and so dedicated can long endure. We are met on a great battlefield of that war. Alright, hit the right button again and it stops the recording, okay? Now, assume that you had let that run for 10 minutes, recording a very long speech or t part of a TV show. You can even use music or Gregorian chants or whatever the heck you want. After you got that done, you go down here and hit the menu button. When the menu comes up in mode B, it, it looks really similar to mode A, only there's no speed adjustment. You see this top button here, compass trigger on. You can turn this on or off. Um, if you have the compass trigger on, whenever the phone moves like, like so, it will trigger the, the sound data bank to uh, put out sounds for the spirits to use. So you can, ask, you can hold it still and ask a question, uh, what's your name, and then go like that and it'll turn it on for the spirits to talk. It also toggles you back to the main to the main uh, screen here. <laughs> so um, I would start out with a mic gain really low because once it starts you don't want to have it screaming at you. You can always turn it up so start on the lower side. Um, this controls your echo delay. If you got it way over here it's going to echo forever down here will echo a little. I prefer a smaller echo, but you can adjust that any speed you want. Um, and then these are the reverb settings here. If you click reverb settings, you can see it's got all these different screens, um, these dials and stuff. I'm not an audio engineer, so I cannot tell you <laughs> what those mean, but I suppose you could look them up or Google them and it would tell you what they meant. Uh, the important thing here is the slider bar at the bottom, and uh, that controls the volume of your reverb. Um, you can have it either all the way up, halfway, or you can turn it all the way off. Um, it's not much point in having reverb on if you have it all the way to zero, obviously. Okay, uh, back takes you back to the <coughs> your menu. You hit start reverb. If you want reverb, you don't have to use it. And then start will start the sounds for your session. It'll automatically start using your sound bank. Adjust your mic gain up until it starts to feed back. Hello? 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 What do I want? I want to talk to you. No. No. Oh, 
here. All of you are here? Did you hear him say all of us are here? Did you say all of you are here? Can you tell me your name? Earl? What do I want? I want to talk to you. Will you talk to me? Okay, and that's, that's basically it. That's how you do a session in Mode B. Um, it takes a little bit longer because you have to build your data bank every time. You can't save it. There's no way to save a data bank. As soon as you exit the SAP, it's going bye-bye. All right. Um, let me know if you have any questions, and I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you.